going on guys? I'm Dr. Kitty Fox. How's it going everybody? And today, we'll be doing an RC video on my Traxxas Slash two-wheel drive. And, we, and we're doing a new project on this truck as well. A new project. And here we are, my Traxxas Slash two-wheel drive. Uh, you, see, you see a few feet of feeding I've done to it is I put the, put the body back onto it, the old body for it. And I got some big wheels for it, so I made it into basically a kind of little monster truck. It's really cool. But yeah, I'm going to put it on a table, and we're talking about it. Stuff I got plans for in the future, because I got a lot of plans for it. The upgrading plan stuff for it. So the rest, let's get right into it. So I got it on the table. How's it going, everybody? <laughs> so I got it on the table here. Uh, I'm trying to keep the truck... On the table because the um it's been leaking water from it, so I don't want to I don't want to leak down the over the water water, so I, I have to dry it off because uh, I spilled water on it, so I washed it up this morning. Try to wash it up, but it's like it's just it's still a stain of dirt from sitting and sitting sitting out sitting for a while. But I need to fully wash it out with a with a hose or something to get all the rest of the dirt off of it because it's still pretty dirty inside. So I've got the old body here. I'm sure you guys remember the old body from my old older videos. The old body on here. Do you like it? I'm thinking about getting a new body for it in the future. A new body for it. And inside, I've done a few things as well. Here, I'll open the body and show you very quick. All right, that screws off in the body, and there he is. Uh, I'm sure you guys don't remember a lot from my older videos is I used to have a tracks a, a standard Traxxas chassis and also I got I, I got the I got the lower chassis for the lower chassis that Traxxas makes the lower one so I got a new chassis for it. Uh, I got a new receiver box because mine uh, fell off and I and it broke off so I had to replace that one. And I've got and I found some tires of on my uh, old Tampa tires from the XL Times MP to put them on the slash, see how they are. They do great, but they're a little heavy and it's just a little slower. Uh, I'm not hitting I'm not hitting, I'm not hitting the 66 six miles per hour on these tires as much. Uh, this truck does the 60 miles per hour because I, I, I put a new opinion gear in and it goes 60, but these tires weigh a lot for this truck, so it's not, it's not going to do it. It's great for show, but not great for bashing these tires, so. In general, I'm thinking about getting a new body and some new wheels that make it kind of like this right here and yeah that is my next project to turn it into the 2010 Ford Raptor and I think in general all I'll need to complete this setup is the new wheels and the body basically uh, most likely I'll probably buy a clear body and paint it myself and I don't I don't know what buy the, the color to choose it from because the, the Raptor body when it came out only came with white red blue and black but I'm thinking about doing, I don't know, I'll, I'll get some paint in, I'll, I'll get some paint, some paint and see what you guys think, what I should do. So, keep in mind the colors I do not like are plain green or usually a torque, or a dark, dark red. So, but I'll let you guys choose what colors I, I should go for, so, in general. But most likely, but most likely, but most likely, if I do get it, I'll probably turn into, I'll probably make it like kind of like a bluish rafter because the blue blue rafter was pretty good, it was pretty proper back then. The blue rafter or the white and the white, the white as well, the white the white was was good as well, or the orange was good as well. But who knows? First, first you get the body, you get a clear body, and paint it and paint it. And it, I, I, I also need to like buy some paint because I think I'm low on orange paint as well. But I'll pick some up as well. But let's see how it goes. I'll let you guys choose the body colors. I should go for it, maybe make a, make a vote for it, it'd be pretty cool, who cool votes. And whatever color you choose from, I'll basically paint it that color, color. so pretty cool. But yeah guys, so I decided, I said I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to let you guys choose the color for, the, for this truck when I get the body for it. So, let you, you, you guys do a vote for a color for this truck, for my new project for this truck, the Project Rafter, that's what I'm going to call it. <laughs> it's going to be epic. It's gonna be cool when I finish it. I'm gonna be excited when I do this because I, lo I, lo I love the Raptor body. And I, 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 I have plans for it as well. Probably get some um, aluminum shocks as well, make it even tougher. And a vehicle motor and maybe some lights as well. And probably probably do some bucket lights as well in it as well. I haven't done I haven't done bucket lights before, but I'm probably gonna, but I'll probably look at video how to do it and make it kind of look like a real truck basically right, when I finish it. It's gonna be epic when I do it. <laughs> Hehe. 
Well guys, that's in this video guys. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you hit that like button, the sub button where you're at it. And if you guys have any comments about, about my truck or the video, let me know, let me know in the comment below. I'd love to answer them. But all the rest, hope you guys have a good day guys. Thanks for watching. Ciao. Hey guys, it's Dark Kitty Fox here. If you guys like the video, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And I hope you guys have an awesome day.